some hidden motives or hidden agenda, some moral, economic, or um, emotional corruption. Somebody has taken in something, ingested something into the body. Someone is guilty of something. So now you have somebody with a hidden agenda. This is his mom. Not necessarily his birth mom, but a mother. Someone that's a, that's a mother in the tree of life. So someone, someone in his family, their mom, has a hidden agenda. Somebody needs some medical care. So there's some things going on behind this that somebody needs this medical care because they gave them something. They could have did this as revenge or as this person's karma, like they're trying to get back at somebody. Somebody sacrificed someone. Somebody is guilty of sacrificing someone to God. Now, I keep getting this, and I keep getting that, the feeling that this is, like I said, somebody is not right in their mind or something. And this is like somebody is giving this, uh, like a sacrificial, sacrificial lamp, or they, it's like a, these people get in these cults and they do these things. That's what I keep doing. Now you have some things that's not seen clearly or this is at night. So this could have happened at night. He was a victim. He was victimized at night. Or this, he, like some things are not clearly seen so that means people didn't quite know what was going on with him or in the house. But he was a victim. This is some recreational activity or a park. So he could have been Victimized at night in a park. Somebody took it to a park. Because in other spreads, I got that somebody was in water. So maybe there's some water at a park. A park with some water. Park near some water. I mean.
know there was a disagreement or fight, a verbal altercation, a disagreement. Something is broken on the body. Someone is broken emotionally. We got into a disagreement. This can be at a park. I keep saying this is a park. Some type of recreational activity, a place you go to do recreational activity, some type of park. But something happened here. When they were doing some recreational activities, they got into some type of altercation. Something was broken. Then you have this. They were doing some recreational activity with a third party. Something was broken. I mean, not something was broken. This third party, this person, this person could have did something to the body. These things were hidden or this happened at night. So something could have happened to his body, his self, at night by a third party. Which is some molestation. This is some physical, sexual, um, trauma. That's why he was a victim of this. This was somebody he did not know. Because see, this is a third party going on here. So... Someone he did not know, a place he had never been to, a feeling he had never had before, something that's unknown, something or someone unknown to him did this. This is a third party because this is somebody he doesn't know, but somebody that he knows, they know that person. He's a victim. So then you have some recreational activities that's the hidden agenda. So some things somebody do in their recreational time could be some moral, um, sexual corruption, whatever. This is something somebody does in their recreational time. Like I said, this can be a part. Something was broken. This mom is broken emotionally. Something was broken on the body. There was a fight with somebody in the family. So they got into some type of argument here. This was his mom about some things that were going on. This third party needed medical care, or the medical care was because needed. The medical care was needed because of a third party. Some this third party did something to cause him to need some medical care. And they did this as revenge to this person or to this body. Like, oh, that's what they get type of thing. Something was ingested into the body. This was hidden. So they don't quite know. Like, it's not known that they were giving him this. So they could have gave him a drug. So they could do this to him. So, like I say, this is like, I keep getting that this is like a cult-like thing, because what, what would the Most High or Divine Timing would have to do with this? This is like a cult, cult-like, this don't have to be religion related, this is somebody, could be a created religion in their mind, this is what they do, okay, in that group. See, they sacrificed him. In an unknown place, something that was not known to him. To someone that's not known. Somebody is guilty of making him a victim. Victimizing him. This is Orson.
somebody wants to leave a situation, they want to be free, they want to go their own way, they want to do their own thing. Sexual. There's no reason sexual should be in a child's bread, but you got some sexual activity. Somebody close to you, somebody in your group of friends, somebody in the community. So now you have, this is a weapon, okay? This is something in the family, family related thing, so. There's some sexual activity going on in the family. Traumatized child, someone in your group of friends or community, someone you associate with. Traumatize this child. This is third party. Now, weapon being used, jealousy, envy, hate. Somebody wants to do things their own way. So somebody was jealous or hate had some type of hate for someone. And they decided they're going to handle this in their own way with this weapon. Then you have some sexual activity going on here within the family. Then you have somebody being honest and truthful about this. So somebody told somebody, yeah, I'm doing some sexual activity with somebody, whoever it was, in the family. So now somebody got some hate here. Somebody in the, you hang around your group of friends, somebody you associate with, there's some cheating. This is somebody on the side. So somebody's dealing with somebody in, in their group of friends. Then you have this child being traumatized because of this. So this looks like either this could have been the mom broken up over, what's his name? Trezell doing some sexual activity with somebody in the family, uh, in her family, in his family, whatever, but see, somebody's on the side with somebody that they, they know, that she knows about. And this is like a revenge for him doing that. See, sacrifice, something in her head.
can't let it go. So somebody told her, this mom, that there was some sexual activity going on with somebody in the family. Something, I don't know who in the family. But she could not let that go. So she did something to these boys as revenge. Now everybody want to come in here and cover it up because they don't want to know. First of all, they don't want nobody to know what they got going on in the family. So they can't tell on her like the reason why she did it. Alright, that's um, Orson West. Tell me what you think in the comment section.